What is going on everybody? Welcome back to MG Marine Tech. Today we are going to be covering a brand new product line from Miller Tech Batteries and that is their sport series of batteries. We're going to be covering one in particular and it's one Miller Tech just sent over my way and it is a 36 volt 60 amp hour battery that is designed for trolling motors. This is one battery that will replace the job of three batteries. What we're going to be talking about today other than Miller Tech Sport Series batteries are the advantages of switching over to lithium over your standard lead acid batteries. I know what you guys are gonna say is lithium batteries are expensive and they are. What you are getting for your money is well worth it. The performance and the longevity of the battery are second to none. These batteries are definitely worth the money in the long run. Let's dive right in, show you guys some of the major advantages to switching to lithium, and let's go over Miller Tech's new Sport Series of batteries. Here is one of Miller Tech's Sport Series batteries. These are brand new this year. This is their 36 volt, 60 amp hour single battery. This comes in at a group size like 31, which will fit in the same exact place as something like one of these. And that is exactly what it is gonna be replacing. All three of these batteries are now done better by this one single battery in my boat. We're gonna be going over all the advantages of this real quickly here. Right off the bat, you're gonna notice that this thing is now Bluetooth compatible. We'll be going over the app here shortly, show you all the cool things you can keep track of inside this battery on your phone while you're out on the water. Also new to the sports series, they offer a 10 year warranty with these batteries. If there is ever any issue, they're gonna fix it, replace it, do what they gotta to do to keep you as a happy customer. That is one of the great things from Miller Tech is that they stand behind their product. Before we dive into the app for Miller Tech's new Sport Series batteries, I wanted to get, kind of go over and show you guys some of the advantages of switching to lithium over your standard lead acid batteries. One of the biggest advantages to a lithium battery is the ability for a lithium battery to supply a relatively consistent voltage throughout the entire charge cycle of a battery. Now with your standard lead acid batteries, the voltage is going to continually drop the second a amp load is placed onto it. The best way I can relate that to you guys is trolling motor setups. When you have standard lead acid batteries, they're freshly charged up and you hit the water, you're going to have great performance out of your motor. You may be able to move around on speed three or four relatively well. Now throughout the day, as it goes on, you're gonna find yourself having to bump it up to five, then six, then seven. And by the end of the day, you might have to be on speed 10 to achieve any kind of usable performance out of your trolling motors. With lithium, that is not the case because that voltage stays very consistent throughout the entire charge cycle of that battery. The next biggest advantage, capacity. Now, when we're talking about capacity, we're talking about the amount of usable energy that is inside of that battery. And the more capacity you have, the longer the battery is gonna last you on the water. Obviously, we do not wanna have power issues when we're out on the water, so you want more capacity. This is really kind of broken down into two parts of the battery, energy density and the depth of discharge. Lithium batteries have a much, much higher energy density, and simply put, this means that you can pack a whole bunch more energy into a smaller space. So size for size, a lithium battery is going to have a much higher capacity. Now the second part of this is depth of discharge. Depth of discharge, simply put, it is the percentage that a battery can be discharged without hurting that battery. Lithiums are around 90 to 100% depth of discharge. Standard lead acids are 50 to 60%. Right there is a huge advantage for the lithiums. They have that much deeper depth of discharge. Now, what does this mean for standard lead acid batteries? If you do go above that 50 to 60% depth of discharge, well, you're only going to be hurting that battery's overall lifespan as well as its overall capacity. So the more you discharge it very, very deeply, the more you are hurting that battery, shortening its life and actually making the battery smaller and smaller. The next advantage we're gonna be talking about, size and weight. This is my old trolling motor setup. Three 12 volt, 100 amp hour, standard lead acid batteries. Each one of these batteries weighs right around 60 pounds. So that is 180 pounds of batteries. Miller Tech's 36 volt 60 battery comes in at 41 pounds. That is a weight savings alone of 140 pounds there roughly. The last advantage we are gonna be talking about is the longevity of the battery 
or the lifetime that you can expect out of these different types of batteries. These are most of the time rated in charge cycles. A charge cycle is from the battery being fully charged to it being discharged partially and then being charged back up. Standard lead acid batteries, you are looking at in the hundreds. Now this varies from manufacturer to manufacturer, but 200, 300, 400 charge cycles is about the average for a standard lead acid battery. Lithiums, on the other hand, you are looking at thousands of charge cycles. Millertech rates theirs at over 3,000 charge cycles out of their battery. So these things are gonna last you a lifetime. As I mentioned, Millertech's new Sport Series batteries are Bluetooth compatible. So let's pull up the app here real quick and kind of go over some of the features of this app. Now, it doesn't have a bunch of crazy stuff going on, which is nice. It's a very simple, easy to use, easy to read app, but it's basically monitoring four main things of your battery. The state of the charge, how much capacity you have left, uh, the temperature of the battery, which is important for when you are charging your battery. You do never want to charge this battery or any of these batteries below 32 degrees. So that is an important feature there, as well as the current amp draw. So that is really, really cool. You can see how many amps you are drawing at any particular point in time. And they will also tell you like how much runtime you have left on the battery at that typical amp draw, etc. It will also show you the amount of times or how many charge cycles that battery has on it. Down below, you will also see that it has any error messages or error warnings that have come up in the past, and it will keep track of those throughout the, uh, you know, the lifetime of the battery as well. All right, guys, thank you for watching. That was all of the major advantages of switching over to a lithium battery over your standard lead acid battery. Now to round things up, in simplest terms possible, a lithium battery is gonna give you almost two times more runtime compared to a comparable size standard lead acid battery. Not only that, it's going to give you top performance, top power, top voltage out of your battery for that entire charge cycle. We just covered Miller Tech's new Sport Series battery. This is just one of the many batteries in this series. They are going to continue to add batteries to this lineup. They currently have the one we just covered, which is the 36 volt, 60 amp hour battery, but they also have a 12 volt, 100 amp hour battery, as well as a 12 volt, 135 and 190 amp hour dual purpose battery. That is a starting and deep cycle lithium battery. Yes, you can start your marine engine with a lithium battery. I have a video uh, covering all of that that I did a few months back. And if you guys are in the market for lithium batteries, please give Miller Tech a look. And if you are wanting to further support this channel, I am a dealer for Miller Tech, so you can contact me or them and get your batteries, the right ones, the first time. If you guys haven't already, please hit that subscribe button down below and stay tuned for more tips and tricks on MG Marine Tech.